Hey guys, uh, I'm back. Last episode, we helped Glenn and uh, that girl shot herself in the motor in. Uh, you may have realised this isn't where we left off. Uh, I just It's not that far, I just went back into the office, collected uh, Lee's dad's old remote and came out here. So, let's carry on with the story. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. I just hope the power's still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AD. Let's try. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. Damn it. There's glass in the way. But, you know, we could make you gas with. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we could make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Awesome. Now to distract those things. Carefully. I can't reach that brick. Oh, God's sake. Even I can't. I, I, I'm crap at throwing. But that's the decent enough throw to get a heavy brick all the way out. I guess it is heavy stuff. But also to get the accuracy right. I'm not here when the zombies. Now's the time. Alright. It could run for it. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Hey, brother. Hey, brother. There's a name you just want to be discovered. I know if you were there. Hey, when the sky is falling down. You not in this world I wouldn't do. I got to do this now, man. I got to do this. Holy crap! 
crap! Run! Well, they can't run, and I'm black, so laws of physics, yeah? I run fast, see? Thank you. Wait, why did I break the lock? But we did it. I mean, like, surely I would have known the code. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. When I first played this, I thought she was someone important, like Lee's mum, but nah. It's not until you find out what's around the corner. <laughs> she is just walking to... No, that was bad timing. She is just walking to... The... Drugstore! Like every other zombie. As I said before, the guy just came in the Come on, give me time to go. I love the comic book too. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Mike, that door's not locked anymore. Shit! You three, get on it! I'll get back as fast as I can! Stay away from the windows. They don't fall. Well, you see, Doug is more useful, but Kai's good with a gun. But Doug is more useless. So. I'm going for
downgraded temporarily to an eight, with attacks and rioting being reported in all precincts. Citizens are currently Ugh, stay in their tired. What time is it? It's six o'clock. When I'm filming this. With uncountable severe emergencies in all counties, Georgia's cities and their current level of disaster are as follows. I can't even hear that. Atlanta, stage 9 I catastrophe. Augusta, stage 8 I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Find your friends. Be safe. Thanks, Lee. That means a lot. I don't mean to abandon you all, but this seems like an okay setup. And I'm sure things will be back to normal around here in no time. Let's hope. You guys be safe. We'll try. And Lee, you know, if this doesn't get better, people are going to give up. If they go from upstairs. <coughs> are you just gonna let them? You told Carly to give her the gun. Yeah, I did. Maybe you were right. I don't know how to handle something like that. Anyway, see you around. Kenny. Kenny, Kenny, Kenny. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Earlier, I uh, mentioned you gotta ask yourself what you're gonna do if Clementine's parents don't show. Yeah, you did. You think that's gonna happen? Her parents showing up? No, I don't. Well, I want you to know that I think you've got it in you. I think you can take care of that little girl just fine. You think so? Thanks, I know so. You got it. Okay. Then we have to go over here. How you doing, Doug? Doug? We couldn't save her, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I. I know it's stupid. We just met. It's dumb. But, uh, I mean, it's, it's probably just that survivor thing. I really liked her. She liked you, too. Thankfully. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, I... Lee? Oh. What is it, buddy? How did you choose? I mean, we both needed you. You picked me. I was going to help you both. That makes sense, I guess. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish you would have picked her. And if you pick Carly, she's going to do the same thing and says, I wish you picked Doug first. It's all like I thought Super Dinosaur was toast. But you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then... Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. So? They can't really help us. But, I know, it's just... I need it. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's, it's gone. gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. 
Mm. I don't think Let I want to. Oh man, Clementine, another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me, so. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. You watch yours, old timer. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That reporter is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, yep, we right. got light, all right. No, guys, I think it's going to be okay. No oh, shit, wait. <gasps> End of episode one. Well, that was a fun episode. Did it quite quickly, I would say. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? Keep it. Hey, I owe you a lot more than a half-eaten candy bar. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. is it for episode one a new day episode two oh cry for help Ooh. okay obviously this is my let's play so light when did i lie i don't actually remember when i lied if you guys wouldn't mind leaving that in the uh description uh comments below then please do i'm really on the other side chose duck okay i knew loads of people chose sean but for sake of later in the game i'm choosing duck side with kenny i also did that because of later in the game if irene the gun i just did that because it felt like i needed to it felt like if sh she has a right if she wants to kill herself and when i chose doug or carly again i chose doug because i believe Carly is the exact same story. They'll probably say the exact same things. So, it, it's just a matter of you want a boy or a girl. So, guys, that's it. We don't really need to look at that. Uh, but anyway, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed as I did say before. Remember, likes always appreciated. Feedback in the comments is always always is always appreciated. And remember to subscribe for more content. See you next time, and goodbye. <laughs>